morning guys welcome to today's video gabby says i look like a teletubby the yellow one la la which if i'm gonna look like if i'm gonna look like a teletubby i want to look like the yellow one i love the name la la anyways welcome to today girls just went outside to take their puppies and boy has it been a day and a night it's been crazy you guys when we got molly she practically raised herself she came into our house and we said this is what we want you to do and she said oh, okay no problem easiest puppy alive like she's so easy we got daisy and basically all hell broke loose this is our house with the new puppy you guys yeah we have to block we have to block off, off everything yeah because she's not like molly on her <laughs> no. third day on her third day, Molly was just running around doing yeah. her first whole day. <laughs> how's it been, Sophie? Tell us, tell us truthfully. Tell us, how's it been with annoying. the puppy? <laughs> what's been annoying, Sophie? Her crying all day. Well, the crying is not that bad. Tell us what's she really been bad. After her. She's like a. She doesn't like going outside. <laughs> she runs to the steps and climbs them. Yeah. The so. Stairs. So, all right, let's make a list here. Let's just say, I think the biggest. Always get a border collie because <laughs> Molly on her first and but second you know day. What's good, I can catch up to her easily. I'm Molly on slow. her first and second day was so well behaved. She was just oh. adapting to the heat. Yeah. Yeah, and on her Molly. It's when she ran around here and she was fine. Yeah, so Molly was like not as socialized. She was scared. She was nervous. So she was really quiet, really calm. This and then just when she me. came like out of that and she started to get happy, she was like, we'd say, here's your toys. And she'd be like, oh, okay, I'll just have these toys. Like she never would have touched anything else. Like she never really chewed out. My puppy cleaned up. up. <laughs> yeah. She found every piece of dirt, every speck of fluff from Molly's toys, every. Sophie, Sophie's been running around like a mad woman. I haven't even eaten or drinking yet. <laughs> Welcome to Parenthood. Welcome to Parenthood, sister. Like, let's put her down and show them what she does. So, let's put her down and see what happens. All right, so first of all, she Sophie couldn't even do her homework, her school, because the puppy kept going up the stairs. Molly wants a friend to play with. Oh, you want to play with me, Molly? No, she wants you to play tug of war with her. Daisy actually fights the other dogs. Look at that little police dog. Okay. She's peeing on the floor, Sophie. No. No. Sophie just came in from taking her pee. She has to go out pee by herself because she... The other dogs bother her. Oh, my God. Sophie took her out. Like... Three times this morning, and Molly and Ruby weren't even out there. You gotta get, oops, you gotta get a cloth and clean that too. Otherwise, you'll smell it, and she'll just keep peeing there. So basically, Dalmatians are no border collies. Okay, so here's something I really want you guys to think about. Don't forward, this is really important. Imagine you're at school. Imagine you're at school, and you just don't fit in there. Like, it's just not your place. You do not fit in there. Like... And you think that there's something wrong with you because you just do not fit in there. Like, everybody fits in at school except for you. But then, imagine you're a border collie Last and somebody night. buys you and you go to a home in town. And they buy you and they love you and they take you out running and then they put you in your crate and they go to work all day. And then they come home at night and you've destroyed your whole entire crate. You've peed everywhere. You've done horrible things. And they're like, I take you out running every night. How come you're not fitting in? But then somebody like us buys a border collie and I, we can't imagine a better breed, a better dog, a better life because she fits into our life so easily. We open the door, she, she runs to the barn. Really well. Yeah. So imagine how a border collie fits our life so completely but she doesn't fit everybody's life it's the same with school when you have to go out there and you have to find your place you guys you have to find your people you have to find where you fit you have to find where you fit i don't know how to explain it i just don't want you to feel like when you don't if when you find yourself in a place that you don't fit don't take it into your heart don't feel like there's something wrong with you there's not something wrong with you it is normal not to fit everywhere out there oh, in life let too. me tell you there are lots of places that we haven't fit tell them what happened last night with daisy what did she do um she brought back one mom's pack of gum and there was only one piece of gum in it so i had to take it from her tell her what she did to molly 
Last night, this puppy grabbed Molly by the tail and tried to oh. drag her across the floor. Yeah, and then Molly started spinning around. Like, oh my god, I don't, I don't like this. I think she's deaf. Anyway, she's not deaf. We, she had a hearing test. She's not deaf, and she does hear us. She's just not. She's. We're just so deaf. used to What's smart it? Molly. Yeah, like. She's a laid back, relaxed puppy. She's not the kind of puppy that like lives on our every word. Yeah, she's we gonna like be... lives on our every yeah, word. We do. No, I don't. I do. Yeah, we do. <laughs> it's okay. She's Even cute. My dog gets annoying at night because all she wants to do is like she'll bring you her toy and then you have to throw it for her. Then she'll make it so loud as she runs. Yeah, it's true. There are so many differences between Maybe. the two of them. Where yeah. Molly sucked was that she did not like the crate. She didn't. She did not ever like the crate. And she let the whole world know. Whereas Daisy cries for a few seconds and then it's like, I like this crate. I'll just sleep here. She slept really well. Also, it was annoying trying to get Molly to eat. Molly does not love eating. Molly still doesn't eat. Molly still doesn't love eating. And Daisy lives for food. Like we brought her into a new house. She doesn't with, like drinking. Well, she does like drinking. I don't think she knows how to drink. I don't think, because she was in a big litter, I don't think she, like, had buckets of water at her disposal all the time. All her food was watered down with a lot of water. So if I give her a bucket of water, she doesn't really seem to know what to do with it. But if I pour a bucket of water on top of her food, she'll, like, drink the water on top of her food. Anyway, she's not a chaser. She's, they're, they're running dogs, though, so I don't know why she's not a chaser. Probably because every Dalmatian has a different... She's definitely much more interested in everything else around her. Like, she's pulled everything out from under the couch. She likes the things she can't have. Yeah. Maybe she's addicted to cleaning. Molly's jealous. Yeah, Molly's jealous. Ruby's a little jealous. Ruby's just like, we're going through this again? Yeah. Molly is very jealous. But we're showing her lots of love too because she's still a puppy. She's only six months old and she's still our beloved puppy. Look at look, look mom. mom. Don't play with the puppy, play with me. Aw. The puppy likes to be held a lot. No, she doesn't. When you pick her up, she wants down. Like Molly loves her toys and the other puppy couldn't care less about toys. The other thing about Daisy that is hilarious is that she lays on the bed and she drags herself. Well, yeah, she does that thing where she like, if you call her and she's laying on the bed, she'll like drag, she'll pull herself army crawl with her arms and then her whole body will drag along. But the other thing she does is that she falls asleep. So you're holding her, she's laying beside you and you rub her belly and she passes out. And when she passes out, a bomb could go off. You could lift her up, swing her around, and she oh stays God. asleep. <laughs> you can, like, you could accidentally fall on the crate and it fall down and she would not. Yeah, she doesn't hear anything. She's just like, yeah, like to us, she's so super lazy because we have Molly and Molly is not lazy. Yeah, Molly. she's really cute though. All right, I made a mistake. This puppy is not dumb. She's really smart. Watch this. Not as smart as Molly. Molly watch, it watch. Make her do it sit. again. Just sit. Like... No, no, do sit again. Make her walk. Ruby, come here. Ruby. Oh, I trained her to come too. Tell Daisy. her. Daisy. 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 All right, watch one, this. Sit. One sock off, sit. one sock off. Sit. 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 Put it back over her head. There you go. Good girl. You have to say good girl. Because eventually you'll be saying good girl and no treats. Little teeny tiny pieces. She sits in space. I taught her well. I taught her all the tricks in one. All the bundles. Mm -hmm. It is hours later. It may seem like we're still doing the exact same thing. We finished school. We ate lunch. And now we're training the puppy. But you know what's super funny is that. Oh, I made cake. Come see. Come on. All right, let's go see Gabby's cake. So the funny thing is that, look at her, she's so slow. Why like, is she still sitting though? Aw, uh, like, so Gabby taught her to sit with the treat and holding it up, and then after, just now, Gabby said, was just standing there and said sit, and she sat right away, and then Gabby walked away and didn't give her a treat, and she did this. Like, what, what, where's my treat? Isn't she smart? Oh, right. I'm actually shocked that she's so she smart. She actually lifted her foot up that time. Yeah. But she didn't put it in my hand. She's adorable. She's what the heck? <laughs> she's peed Why more. Why do you only know how to pee? <laughs>
Um, so these two marks are from when I tried to stick the fork in the cake there and it wasn't done. And then I did it when it was done. So are you proud of this cake, Gabby? Yes, A I 13 am. and a half that you made this cake? I've made cake before. Oh, this pan's still hot. So this is Gabby's cake. Who's going to eat the cake? Hot. Who's going to eat the cake? All me. <laughs> yes, because... It feels like the puppy's stomach. Feel it. Did oh, you wash yeah. your hands though? Y'all been yes. holding on to a puppy. I put this right there. Aww. Oh, she's getting really paw. Yeah. She, yeah, Aww. she gets it. Oh my gosh, she gets it. Aww. Make her sit. Sit, paw. Good oh, girl. Where's the cheese? <laughs> You're a genius. We got two genius puppies. I thought she was lazy too. Like I didn't think she'd be that Daisy found her first piece no. of horse poop today. And um, look at that little tail. She dropped it as soon as I picked her up. All right, so uh, we're down to feed lunch. The real vlog, the horse part of our, the horse edition to our vlog is about to start a little bit later because my car is in the shop. Go ahead, cut it, please. Edward scissor hands. Edward scissor hands. Because my car's in the shop, we have to wait for Sam to get home and Gabby has special plans for today for riding. Okay, you throw hay and I will clean the barn, clean the poo. Does she run? She runs outside. Oh, I literally love a good looking puppy. That's it, so. The only thing we didn't want in a Dalmatian was we didn't want like, you know how some of them will get like really the black circles around their eyes? Yeah. And her and her, her parents both don't have that. She does have a little bit of a brown around one. But hopefully she won't get that. I thought her that. mom or her dad had a little bit of a brown. Yeah, a tiny bit. Like what she has. What? I love that the top of her head barely has any spots. I know. Do you still love her? Like are you still shocked? Yeah, and Sophie does let her run, and she does let her play, but the puppy actually prefers to be carried. She actually prefers to take naps. Yeah, she's lazy. But smart as heck, who knew? So, Dalmatians are, were bred long ago to run along carriages and protect them. Horse-drawn carriages, so they're horse dogs. Oh. Willow's scared of her. Yeah, Mo uh, Molly was terrified of the... Uh, the horses. See if she likes Gracie. <laughs> Let's see how she does now. <laughs> Gabby's like, you may think my dog's not a puppy anymore, but she's still my baby. Mine can do that. Uh, yep. Yours is struggling. Mine is just living life. <laughs> Mine is an actual baby. Oh, apparently baby. female chickens struggle. I mean, yeah. Struggle let's go. When you hold them upside down. Yeah. And males struggle. <laughs> Okay, put her down. My dog is a female. All right. <laughs> Your dog is a female. Let's hold you up and see if you're a female. Chrissy. You would struggle. Chrissy. Yeah, I would. You couldn't even lift <laughs> me, though. Sticks her nose, sticks her nose right in Gracie's nostril. Ew. Her whole head can almost fit in there. So the dogs She's look. ready for a nap. Yeah, the dogs look way bigger in uh, the camera. The camera adds 20 pounds, you guys. Remember that. While you're looking at mom now. Yeah, while well, you're looking at me. She's scared. Yeah, she's not scared. She's also ready for a nap. Yeah, this puppy needs a lot of naps. She has a lot of naps. Yeah. She has so much. Molly barely naps as a puppy. I know, not like this puppy. This puppy naps. Okay, so we have created this little puppy playpen for Daisy so Sophie can actually read at night in her room and so that Sophie can actually clean her room and actually do something without being chasing the puppy 24-7. Did she pee? Yeah. Outside? Yeah, she ran away from me and then peed. Yeah, good. She runs away from people. She tells us when she has to pee, doesn't she? Yeah, she cries too much. Yes, yeah, so when she has to pee, she just cries. Now she's exhausted. She's had lots of running, lots of peeing. Like she, she loves her bed. Oh, she found a ball. Uh oh. She wants out. Yeah. She's a little. She's gonna rip that pee pad up. Yep. That's your, that's your new home when your owner's trying to get stuff done up here. I'm gonna chill up here for a little bit after. 
That's your bed. Get used to it. All right, we are at the barn. And I have Molly here. We have Molly here. She's on a harness. Why do we have Molly here? Because wait till you guys see. Come, Come on, on, Molly. Hey. I have a feeling this is going to be harder than I thought, or it's going to be easier than I thought. It's going to be harder. Come on. We missed our horses yesterday. We didn't come because we had such a busy day. And they're officially away from the area that they love. Are eating horse poo. Don't eat horse poo, Molly. Are you going to be able to handle this? Probably. If I give Molly to Dad, I'll come with you. All right. Through to Narnia. I don't know where Gabby is or the horses because I went to drop off the dog. Basically, the plan for today, oh, our horses are right here. I don't know where Gappy went. Our horses are always, oh, she's there. I hate that they have to hide in here from the other horses. How'd you, did you do Storm's leg? <laughs> Gino, come back. They don't want to be ridden. See, you missed one day. How was? The, how were they, dude? You got a big lesson tomorrow, and then a show. So, have fun today. Gabby just put the medicine on Storm's leg. All right. So the plan for today is going to be a. Darker. Do you see the top of his back and his butt? Storm was darker. Chino. Chino. Yeah. Look at that and this. This is kind of. See, dark and light. It's an ombre. I mean, his butt. So, the plan for today is a big one. Kaylee lives by this barn. She lives about a two minute drive, which is like a long walk. <laughs> and Gabby wants to ride Chino to her house, ride at her house, and then ride Chino back. So, so that's what we're gonna try, you guys. We're gonna try it, and I brought Molly. Uh-oh. So I'm gonna walk behind Gabby and bring this girl, and she's hopefully gonna drag me. You gonna drag me, Molly? It's gonna be Gabby's solo, first solo ride on the road, and we have to cross a busy road. And the next week they have like really big plans, so her and the older girls at the bar. So we're gonna try it out, see how it goes. So last night I had a couple of dreams. One, I don't understand it yet. Like, sometimes when I dream, I dream like a weird dream that I don't understand. I need more pieces of the puzzle before I can figure out what the dream means. But I also dreamed a dream that needed no explanation. I was sitting in a hospital bed with a white bandage around my head. Yeah, whenever I have dreams like that, I always like, oh, makes me so sad, you guys, because fall every- Don't uh, I was eating a candy. Every Wait, time, every time I dream a dream like that, I get hurt and it's awful. The first time I dreamed that I was gonna fall and then a few days, four days later, I fell off Stella and broke my pelvis in seven oh, spots. And then the next time I dreamed, me with a head injury then pushed me over i fell down on the ground and got an uh, awful concussion it was like so bad i didn't go to the hospital it was so bad and i had whiplash like it was the worst thing it was so bad watch for it you guys watch for it and pray actually can you guys all pray pray that it doesn't come true pray that i don't end up in a hospital bed uh, no, maybe in, that's like in six years yeah usually it's within two weeks um I have a big ride coming up next week. Mm-hmm. Oh my God, Gabby's already. Wait, wait, slow down. What an idiot. Right, my plan is for this dog to pull me along. All right, we are on our way. Forever. Go down this road forever. <laughs> but we are on our way. Got the beautiful fall foliage. Why are you crossing roads all the time? Oh. Yeah, big hill. Okay, gotcha. Anyways, it's me and my puppy, my girl and her horse, and we are off on an adventure. Good thing she's got a good horse because one in 10 people obey the law. And the law is you're supposed to slow down, move far away from the horse as you possibly can, and then accelerate slowly once you've passed the horse quite a distance. 
But no, nobody does that. They just speed. Do you guys see the hill? I forgot there's a hill. I have to climb that hill. That ginormous hill, I have to climb it. We're holding in. We're halfway, you guys. We're holding in. This puppy's pulling me along. Gabby's way up there. Can't even see her. This puppy's got more energy than me. Let's just take a minute to look at all these gorgeous trees, you guys. Look at that. Isn't it gorgeous? Gabby's about to hit Kaylee's house. And we're not too far behind, are we, my trusted puppy? All right, we made it. We're here. Okay. Take Gabby's water. He didn't spook us a single thing, did he? He spooked out one thing because he saw the field. Oh, you know what uh, your dog spooked at? What? Motorcycle. Oh, I saw those. All right, so Sophie went okay. shopping. Okay, so I got her this mouse. Sophie went okay. shopping while okay. we did our walk. Don't do it in front of the horse. Okay, all right, enough. I bought her. That one black truck got two plus football. Oh, I know, I terrible. Her football because it's soft. Oh, okay, she'll like a football. No! Molly was perfect the whole way. Cream. Shaving cream, you know, which you bought that for. I see her. More glue. LED light thing, so I got her this blue collar because they didn't have any other colors. But they had like. And it has the LED one. light on it? Yeah, we. I bought this LED light so that at night oh. you can see your dog. That collar's gonna be way too big for her I for now. I got that collar but bigger and it was black and it was too big and Molly chewed it. Yeah, I remember it was nice on her and Molly chewed it. But this isn't as big, so she'll grow into it. Super cute, one day we'll be walking your puppy here. So Mr. Ch Chino Bambino seems to look better on the grass now that we have those back boots on him. Putting our life in boxes Erasing the memory so you won't notice I'm taking the time to focus You're by yourself, I'm by myself Wish I could solve your problems You're stuck on my wall like neon paintings And I'm so tired of being honest Everyone by myself, I do it so well We were so good at flying, but we can keep flying We keep getting stuck on the wrong side of the mountain We were so good at trying, but we can keep trying Cause we only end up on the wrong side of the mountain We gave it so Chances when we saw the signs, we just kept dancing. And the night, so it seemed so endless. Thought it would last, now it's in the past. We were so good at flying, but we can't keep flying. We keep getting stuck. Oh boy, I was expecting him to refuse one of the cross country jumps, but he didn't. He jumped them all, he looked at them, but he jumped them. Better than he jumped the jumps with the standards. Hey. He's like, give me my supper. What a good boy. He was so good on the road, huh? Didn't look at anything. Perfect boy. He looks so small in that stall. <laughs> Her head just barely comes there. You're getting to be such a small pony, Finny. Don't you know that you're beautiful?